Bonjour YouTube, welcome back to the channel. I am Noralex. This is gonna be my reaction for episode two of Loki called The Variant. If you are new to Noralex Live, please subscribe. You can even click the bell to make sure you do not miss my next video. So Loki is a variant, prisoner of the TVA. And there is another variant killing TVA agents. And apparently that variant is also Loki. Guys, the first episode was a 10 for me. Script, design, cinematography, music, everything was on point. Tom Hiddleston hacking is probably better than ever. He went from arrogant to sad to amazed to terrified to like he can do it all. And also Owen Wilson is perfectly cast as Mobius. And his chemistry with Hilston is amazing. All right, Marvel, let's see what you got. The variant, here we go. I was about to say, is that middle age? But uh, no, no, it's not. <laughs> it's like, a, oh, but it's 1985 though. Hi, what's going on? You guys aren't dressed right. <laughs> <laughs> You mean not yet? The trap, watch your back. Oh, with the music. This is the 80s. Why are you going disco? What is going on? Yeah, you guys need a hero to stop that. YouTube is gonna never gonna let me put that song in, but whatever. <laughs> Copyrights. Very bad things. Come on, Loki. What is it? <laughs> are you recording or are you alive? Uh, sort of both. Where's your man? <laughs> that is not nice. He's having fun. Come on, gear up. There's been an attack. Let's go. Gear up? He's like an agent now. I love it. Wow. Go. Smart. It's a nice coat. But which kind of Loki remains unknown? They're the lesser kind, to be clear. Let me see the back of that jacket. Variant. I don't want anybody out there to forget what you are. Oh, you're only hope of capturing a murderer. No, a cosmic mistake. A cosmic mistake. Illusion projection and my duplication. Favorite. Cosmic. They're the two completely different powers, actually. How? Illusion projection involves depicting a detailed image from outside oneself, which is perceptible in the external world. Holographic mirror of its molecular structure. But uh, you already knew that. Oh. <laughs> okay, take take a breath. <laughs> Noted. <laughs> because whoever this variant is, we haven't been able to find them. So let's bring in an expert. That's me. Yeah, that's you, Loki. And how's betraying us going to get you any closer to the timekeepers? An audience with the timekeepers is on the table. Keep that focus. Keep that focus. All right, all right. That should be fun. A Loki couldn't have gotten the jump on C20. Uh you underestimate actually fan out and search for her wait it's true they might be underestimating that you loki my ears even sharper we're running out of time mobius hold it drunk with power blinded to the truth those you underestimate will devour you two units he is wasting our time okay come on loki make a long story short we need to yeah let's go loki it's a trap he's waiting for you outside this tent should I secure the research charges? No, he wants me. I'm the key to his plan. Knowing what I now know about his tactics, I can deliver you the variant. Uh, <laughs> God of mischief. And I'll need to speak to the timekeepers at once. They're in graver danger than we realized. He's lying. Just playing games. Reset the timeline. Good try. <laughs> That 
That is so nice. Is it just me or does this office keep getting better and better? Or grimmer. You might need this for our discussion. I hope it's a double. <laughs> Understanding this Loki helps me get closer to the one we're chasing, right? Yeah. I know he is an evil, lying scourge. That is the part he plays on the sacred timeline. Sometimes you get tired of playing the same part. Is that possible? Yeah. Not unless the timekeepers decree it. And how are the old timekeepers? <sighs> they want that variant caught. So do I. This is serious then. Mobius. It's almost gone. <laughs> you really believe in this variant? Luckily, he believes in himself enough for the both of us. And hey, if it doesn't work, I'll delete him myself. He's really arrogant. He is. See, half the fun of being a trickster is knowing everyone knows you're a trickster, and then <sighs> many of your tricks can come from exploiting the fact. Come on, Loki. What happened to the guy I met on the elevator? He didn't like to talk. Remember him? Now I'm stuck with this guy. I won't stop yakking away about what makes a Loki tick. <laughs> I believe, stupidly, that insecure need for validation would motivate you to find the killer. You know this variant is better than you. And he can't take it. Ooh. I'm ten steps ahead of you. I've been playing a game of my own all along. Seize control of the TVA? Am I getting warm? A double cross by history's most reliable liar. Okay, why are you in that situation? A, because I see a scared little boy, and you kind of feel bad for that ice runt. Or B, I just want to catch this guy, and I'll tell you whatever I need to tell you. Fair enough. I don't need your sympathy. Good, because I'm running out of it. <laughs> Man, their chemistry together? Next step is Amazing. Let me park you at this desk, and don't be afraid to really lean into this work. Here's a good trick for you. Pretend your life depends on it. I'm going to get a snack. <laughs> Pretend your life depends on it while I get a snack. Destruction of Asgard. Class 7 Apocalypse Ragnarok. Total planetary destruction. Variance energy. Oh man, that means it was meant to happen. Ragnarok. Are you familiar? Yes, the destruction of Asgard and most of its people. I'm sorry. Yes, very sad. Anyway, it got me thinking. <laughs> Let's just say, what are you doing? Your salad is Asgard. No, in this scenario. It's not Asgard. It's, That's it's my lunch. Just hang in there. I want and that salad. <laughs> I can push the Hulk off the Rainbow Bridge. There he goes. The salt's Hulk. Set fire to the palace. No, just stop. Don't set fire okay. to the palace. <laughs> I can do what? Oh, God. You. Hey, him again. No, don't do. <sighs> Ragnarok obliterates the salt. There it is. What am I looking at? Okay, it was a <laughs> clumsy metaphor, but you see what I mean? It could be a tidal wave, it could be a meteor, it could be a volcano, a supernova. A snap because the timeline's not going to branch because it gets destroyed. That's kind of smart, though. Not gonna take me to a real apocalypse, take me to Ragnarok. I'll show you. Oh, yeah, so you can run away back to your homeland. <gasps> Mobius, come on, what could possibly go wrong? Everything you lure me out into the field and then you stab me in the back, and that's a theory I don't want to test. I never stab anyone in the back. <laughs> Such a boring form of betrayal. <laughs> You've literally stabbed people in the back like 50 times. I never do it again. Because it got old. <laughs> you don't trust me, you can trust one thing. I love to be right. That I agree. Italy, what year is it? Oh, 79. We don't want to get too giddy. Oh, come on. It's cool. No, we're all going to die anyway. I know. Now, listen. <laughs> no one wants to get mad. You, anything we do can impact the course of history. Do you get that? Yes. Loki! Loki! Mihi Norman est Loki. Trifectus concilii ad tempus mutandem. Atque ad vero ad iste mos. Ignes pathos per cycle. Oh, my God, man. Come on. With a smile. 
<laughs> Look at it, Loki. <laughs> Don't believe it. Zero variance energy, no branching in the timeline. All right, so move now. This is where I would hide. Uh, yeah. <laughs> Three magic lizards. Timekeepers. Created the TVA. And everyone in it, right. including you. Including me. Who created you, Loki? Odin, god of the heavens, Asgard, frost giants. Listen to it's yourself. It's not the same. It's completely no, no, different. No, no, no. It's oh, not yeah, the same. Oh, oh. Yeah, at least there's movies about that. Because if you think too hard about where any of us came from, who we truly are, it sounds kind of ridiculous. Existence is chaos. Nothing makes any sense, so we try to make some sense of it. So everything is written. There's no such thing as free will. Well, I mean, you know, it's an oversimplification. So in fact, <laughs> in a way, when they're finished, what happens then? So are we. No more Nexus events, just order, and we meet in peace at the end of time. What? It sounds boring. I'm sure it does to you. You know, you called me a scared little boy. I called you a lot of things. <laughs> you did. You see, I know something children don't. That no one bad is ever truly bad. And no one good is ever truly good. Yeah. You're very clever. Yes, he is. I know. <laughs> and apparently you too, because you just thought of something. Now we have two variables. Apocalyptic natural disasters and kablooey. What's that? Candy. You have candy on Asgard? Yeah. Grapes, nuts. I wonder you're so bitter. <laughs> okay. was only sold you need a Kit Kat. Famine, volcanoes, God. Oh. Alabama 2050. You're gonna take my job if I'm not careful. I have to tell you that trusting this man is not a good idea. No, 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 I know, but maybe he's worth the trouble. I mean, he just uncovered a massive hole in our security, right? That's what concerns me. <laughs> I can handle You, I trust, but him? Listen, Ramona, every instinct is telling me this is where we nail the variant. I'm, I'm excited. I'm chomping at the bit. Okay. Yes. Yes. There's not much I can do if it doesn't work out. For all time. Better work. Just in case. Oh. Absolutely not. <laughs> Roxcart is a vast superstore common to the era. This warehouse is being used by civilians as a shelter trying to ride out the storm. And if you see a Loki, prune it. The bad thing. Preferably. Haven Hills, Alabama. Oh, yeah, that hurricane is coming. Rocks carts like a Walmart of the future. What the hell was that? <laughs> Using magic to dry my clothes. So I don't announce myself with every squeaky footstep like the rest of you. Uh, 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 yeah. He stays with me. What are you talking? He's under my supervision. This is my field, Op Mobius. You are more than welcome to go back to the TVA and litigate with Renslayer, but right We're now... Here. I hate her. Why is it the people you can't trust are always saying, trust me? Because you can't Why trust them. Oh boy, he's already... Way ahead of you guys. Yeah. I, for one, I'm glad we get him to spend this time Quiet. together. I'm really saying I think we got up on the wrong Shh. Quiet. Whoa, whoa, whoa. It's okay. It's okay. What are you doing? Shopping for plants. In a hurricane? Hurricane sale. His alias are half off. Oh, shh. Me, I presume. Please. If anyone's anyone, you're me. <laughs> the smile and everything. That went bad pretty quick. How the heck did you get here? These people are scared. They're about to die. They should be scared. Okay, not of us. What is it? Oh. oh my god she's there hi are you guys looking for the disaster shelter 
now. Wow, that's pretty quick. Are you going to call your little friends for help? <laughs> Are you? Can you? Do you want to? You know, gaining their confidence was no mean feat. Oh my god. You went undercover. I'm going to overthrow the timekeepers. Really? What say you? Loki. Ugh. Don't call me that. I'm not interested in ruling the Time Variance Authority. Okay. Wait, there's more than one person. I gave it away. What did you give away? The timekeepers, where they are. I gave it away how to find them. Whoa. If you don't want to rule the TVA, then what do you want? It doesn't matter. You're too late. That's your plan. Lure us all here so you can blow the place up. That's actually not a bad idea. <laughs> Thank you for helping me stall for time. You really do love to hear yourself talk. <laughs> what? I would never treat me like this. Hi. Boom. Stop hiding. Uh, Ayoy. What happened? I, Looks like your favorite Loki betrayed you, Mobius. Just move! Wow, 115. What do you want from me? What is this about? <laughs> I don't think it's about you. <laughs> Oh shit, there we go. What is this about? This isn't about you. Wait. Right. What is going on? And who is she? And why does she have Loki horns? Small, but you know. Oh shit, it's sending them somewhere else? Oh boy. This is Analyst 1182E uh, reporting a code. Uh, oh, oh, somebody just bombed the sacred timeline. What? What just happened? Oh, no, he's going to jump through. Oh, boy, you messed up, Mobius. Whoa. Whoa. What did happen? Did, did the guy at the TVA said, like, somebody reset or respawn the secret timeline? Like, like is that what happened? Like, they set a bunch of those... I don't remember how they, they're called, but those like grenades that resets everything. You know, like did he sent a bunch of them at a bunch of places at the same time and just messed up the whole timeline. By the way, TVA is fine and all. I love their 70s design, but you know, they should get like touchstone dials because those old school phones take too much time. <laughs> he said bombed. Somebody bombed the sacred timeline. All right, all right. I like, I like how, where it's going. I'm always, I've always been a fan of time travel stories, Terminator, Back to the Future, Tenet, whatever. <laughs> and I really love what they're doing here. Once again, Owen Wilson and Tom Middleston. I mean, their chemistry, I could probably watch an entire episode of just them like chatting over coffee and tea or something overall i love where it's going i just want to know who was that loki is that a female version of her of him because she had like a crown with like two like loki's horn here 
so I'm expect like what is that like is that another timeline Loki but I don't know I don't know because we haven't seen that character before in the MCU for sure but interesting Ah, and now I'm wondering where he jumped to at the end, like where and that that low key with a knee, like a, a like female low key. I don't know how to call her, whatever. Where she jump into that door and then low key followed. Where is that leading to? Wow, I like how clever low key is. Where she found the thing about like the apocalypse and where the, the you know the variant hiding in the apocalypse because there's no like time repercussions on the timeline anyway it's a good thing <laughs> that whole show is, is a bit complicated to analyze but uh, whatever i'm just wondering where it's going overall but it's i love the mystery it brings i love the adventure it brings and here's the thing the way t the tva agent especially mobius treats loki like oh we can't trust him and i is it me or I feel the same w when I watch Loki? Like, can I trust him? Can we trust him? Even at the end when he was talking to that other Loki and took that other body, he was saying, ah, oh, my goal is to overthrow the TVA and do whatever. But like, is that really his plan? Or is that just him? You know, he's been so used to being the villain all the time. Like, he has to tell people that he has a villainous plan, even though, like, he doesn't want to do that. And the timekeepers, do they even exist? That whole point where they're sitting at the table talking about, like, beliefs and what I believe you don't. That whole, it was very philosophical, metaphysical kind of discussion. Really love it. It just shows that it's that guy who's the writer from Rick and Morty because yeah, it has depth characters like everything's there and the time travel thing you know it's crazy sci-fi and funny so I get it man that show might even be better than WandaVision and Falcon and Winter Soldier like great start great start solid so that was my reaction for episode 2 of Loki please Tell me what you thought about it in the comments below. Give this video a like and subscribe to the channel because 67% of you guys watch my videos but you're not subscribed. I don't understand why. Follow me on Twitter and Instagram at Neuralex. Check out my Patreon, my Discord, and my merch. Thank you again for watching this. I am Neuralex. Until we see each other again, guys, stay safe. Neuralex.